Wszystkich przekonaliśmy? Fajnie. Very good. Very good. The sentiment is surely appreciated, Miss White. But it doesn't disguise the fact that these accusations are completely unfounded. The sheriff simply doesn't have a particle of evidence linking me to the Georgie was working for you. Bigby got a confession. A confession that, that nobody heard. Now, I'm no barrister, but I think such a statement would carry more weight if Bigby weren't the only one to hmm. whom Georgie spoke. Especially given Bigby's history. What are you talking about? Snow? And what about your history? All you've done to this fucking town. What do you mean there's no evidence? Maybe, maybe he's... I mean, this doesn't feel right. How we're so? doing this. I just of need... course it's right. This man tormented all of you for profit. Georgie Let killed him. Let me just make sure I understand. You're trying to say that I'm responsible for what Georgie did, because he was working for me at the time, yes? Yes. Of course. Where are you <laughs> going with this? If I'm to blame for Georgie's mistakes, shouldn't Miss White be held accountable for Bigby's actions as well? Like what? How about the way he treated poor Tweedle D when he was in your Just custody? Yet. He was beaten to mashed apples while under your watch. Under my watch? Przecież to nie my. Przecież to nie my. That was Bluebeard, not me. He was a murder suspect. Besides, Crane was still deputy mayor when that happened. Right before you decided to kidnap him. It was for his own protection. Oh, you're right, dear. Crane was in charge. Sometimes it's hard to tell the difference. That's enough. So. You won't answer for your employees' behavior, but I must perish for this mine. This is completely different. We I all... did not order those two girls dead. It simply never Cholera. happened. Georgie killed Faith and Lily. End of story. They want to escape from their own tangled heads, but they refused to answer for their own sisters. Cholera. Oh, please. This isn't the point. We'll deal with them after we deal with you. Everyone calm down. This isn't I the mean, a certain level of privilege should be afforded to her. This is how it's always been. This is what I'm talking about. We lashed our ropes to this diseased world, and ever since, which one of us has been there for you? Who filled your lives with the promise of more? Who was there while they idly played in their towers, judging you, treating you as mindless children, too stupid to command your own destiny? Serio? Without me. Who will pay your rent when you're on the verge of eviction? Serio? Who will dare challenge their brutality when it leaks to our dear citizens? Who will protect you from the big bad <laughs> wolf? Who will be the Big B? Miss White. Marisa, proszę. Excuse me. I... Dear. I wanted to make sure I had the chance to say something. Why don't you take a moment to catch your breath? As What's she doing here? I'd like to... I, I need to say something. We're kind of in the middle of something. Uh, of course. Go right ahead. You probably don't remember me. I don't know why I was afraid to come My here. Dear, I don't Just know shut up. You enslaved us for years. Let us hear stories about what you do. Told us we would lose everything if we stepped just one toe out of line. And we couldn't say a word about it because of these damn ribbons. <laughs> But you know what? Now it's my turn to talk. Super. I found Vivian's body. Did you kill her? Did he? Sheriff, this is highly irregular. Sama się zabiła. We need to establish some order here. Vivian wanted you freed from the ribbons. She took her own life. I'm sorry, um, I don't think I Nerissa! My name is Nerissa. It's okay, my dear. It's going to be just... He ordered them dead. This fucker. Faith and Lily. I was in the goddamn room when you did it. Faith and Lily are dead because of you. The only two people who ever gave a damn about me. Don't worry. He's gonna pay for it. He made Georgie do it. It was always him. Georgie would have never done anything without his say so. Super. Dziękujemy, Nerisa. Świetnie, że przyszłaś. At least five other girls have backed me up on this. We all heard you say it. Did you now? Looks like we found our evidence. She saw it firsthand. He's guilty. 
Good enough for me. Me too. So that's it, right? Calm down the witching well. No, that's too fucking easy for a crook like that. What do you mean? He's gotta pay for what he did. Listen to yourselves! You're all rats, fleeing from one sinking ship to the next. So quick to latch onto whatever will keep your miserable lives afloat. This is how you want to repay all I've done for you. What? You take two people's lives away and now you want to I can't let you go free after this. What did you expect to happen here? You're getting what you deserve. <gasps> well done then. Now for your sentence. We don't have to become murderers. What are you talking about? He's guilty. I know that, but we don't have to kill anybody. We can imprison him. Lock him up forever. Somewhere he can hmm, never hurt. Hmm, that's about to How can we be sure he won't escape? I can help. We'll use magic. That's I not good him. enough. Maybe there will be more if he isn't he stopped. I don't care. So, so we get rid of him. Get him out of here. We can send him Everyone, away. Everyone, listen up. Clearly, we're having trouble agreeing on a suitable punishment. So I think this we... This is going nowhere. Someone needs to make a decision. Who? I hope you answer this. Why not? What about a vote? We should have a vote. Make it democratic. Do you really think that's going to work? He's right. Nobody can agree on anything. What about Bigby? What about him? He was appointed. He's the only official representative, really. He should be the judge. So? Yeah. You yeah. 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 Are you sure? This is a decision. Okay, Mr. Wolf, it's your call. Snow. Just do what you think is right. Yes, Sheriff. Do what you think is right. Teach him a fucking lesson. No. He has to die. We can lock him Just away. fucking get rid of him. So, <gasps> cholera. Yeah. Yeah. Nie chciałam, żeby to się tak skończyło. Zamkniemy go. To go zaboli najbardziej, tak mi się wydaje. You said you had a way to keep him from hurting people. Wait, you can't be what he's done. You're just gonna put him in prison? This isn't the way, Sheriff. You're doing the right thing. Yes, there's a way. Tak będzie cierpiał. Bardziej, dłużej, intensywniej. Okropna jestem, co? Dobrze, moi drodzy, chyba pociągniemy do końca. Najwyżej podzielę to na dwa odcinki. No już chyba, chyba będzie zaraz po wszystkim. Tak mi się wydaje. Krótko coś. A, dzień dobry. Not what I was expecting. Morning, crooked man. He's got a sharp tongue. I thought it would be better for everyone if he parted. Thanks, Grady. Let's just call it even. Kim ty jesteś? Hey, Sheriff. Benek, nie awantury się. I know who you are, Flycatcher. You've worked at the Woodlands for how many years now? I think I've lost count. Are you gonna come see the truck off? We're leaving for the farm in a few. Thought you might want to. I don't know. I'll be down in a minute. Okay, great. Huh? This fucking line. <laughs> oh, chest. Nick me you love it, so. A może. Oh, uh, Mr. Wolf, Flycatcher left his keys. Listen, Snow. Uh... Can we no. I, I wanted to... I'm, I'm sorry, Sheriff. I have to take care Aww. of this. We'll talk later, okay? Good morning, Miss White. You're late. Tush. Tush. To spojrzenie zabolało. 
Dzień dobry. Niepoprawna świnia. Oczywiście idzie do naszego mieszkania. No dobrze, no już kurna, niech siedzi w tym mieszkaniu i chleje piwo. Niech i tak będzie. Co tu się jeszcze wydarzy? Mnie bardzo ciekawi, co tu się jeszcze wydarzy? Jednak jest się na farmę? Hmm. We only have like five minutes. They carry me for fuck's sake. I don't give a shit. Jakie to przykre kurna. I forgot these. Oh, thank you. It's uh, been pretty busy around here. Morning, sheriff. Nice fucking day. Shit. Mm. Just go grab that, would you? Sorry about all this. Uh, I tried to help. Just why the hell did she have to send me and me boy away, huh? You promised me I'll get another chance. But Miss White said I had to go up to the damn farm anyway. Wait, Sheriff Bigby. I have something. <laughs> you know, he was up crying all night, poor kid. Hmm. Yeah, Can you give this to Miss White, please? Dad says there's no time to say goodbye. So, okay. If you could bring it to her? Yeah, sure. I couldn't take them all with me, and she said she liked that one the best. Oh. It's a willow beetle. That's a big one. They're cool cuz when they're little, they have these pouches that squirt juice at you if you take it. <laughs> I'm sure she'll love it. She said it was pretty. We're about ready to head out. What's it like at the farm? I've heard ogres live there, and, and they eat people in their sleep sometimes. God, I hope not. Do we have to go? I want to stay here. Well, we don't have a choice anymore. Don't worry. You'll be a lot safer there. There's plenty of space to run around, uh, and a nice river nearby so you can swim all you want. Even in daytime? Mm -hmm. Yeah. You don't have to worry about the Monday seeing you. It'll be nice. <laughs> Come on. It won't be so bad. Like a psycho. No. I'm not. Uh, some of the animals aren't comfortable around wolves. So you wouldn't know, would you? We're all set. Hmm. Bye, Mr. Wolf. Goodbye, TJ. Tak po prostu na ulicy rano. Where's a fucking pig? How should I know? I co mamy poradzić, no? A, cześć, Nerisa. Cały czas nosisz wstążkę? Czyżby zaklęcie wciąż działało? Przynajmniej na tyle, że ci głowa odpadnie. It's just let me help. Big B, I I know you're trying to help. But this is just something I need to do on my own. Mm. Okay? Okay, okay. Listen, I I came here because I have to tell you something. No. What is it? It's about what happened to Faith and Lily. No. I'm not sure where to start. No, no. <sighs> Faith, Lily and I, we had this plan. We're gonna find a way out. Leave the pudding and pie for good. But then Faith decided to get some leverage. She stole a picture of Crane and Lily together. Mm -hmm. The minute Faith stole that photo, we had dirt on one of the crooked man's allies. If he found out, I I had no choice. You have to understand. Don't you see how they kept us quiet in that place? Can you imagine the lengths they go just to silence someone who had physical evidence? Larissa, what did you do? I freaked out, okay? Don't you know, I came clean to Georgie. He'd get the crooked man to leave us alone. 
We could just forget the whole thing. Maybe try again in a few years. You what? So I told him everything. And I begged for mercy for all of us. Oh, yeah. I didn't want anyone to die over a picture. You were just trying to protect them. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Georgie promised he'd smooth things over with the crooked man. But then... Oh, God. <laughs> Here. Thank you. To prawie wszyscy palą, co? Nawet ci palące się krzywią, jak Bigby pali przy nich, ale cóż. I don't know what happened, but that night at the club, Georgie came back and told me things had changed. Mm -hmm. He had to make an example of us. We had committed treason. And while the two of us were sitting there, as he was telling me this, Faith walked in, and I had to watch while Georgie... Wait, so Georgie told you all this? Not the crooked man. Back at the well, you said. I know what I said. But it wasn't the truth, was it? What does it matter? I know the crooked man did it. Now you saw. So what if it wasn't the whole truth? It was true enough. So you think that makes it okay to lie? I know he ordered their deaths. I wasn't going to let him get away with it because of a stupid technicality. Especially after. <laughs> that night, after Faith, I tried to warn Lily. But she wasn't with her scheduled appointment. So I did the only thing I could do. I... I left Faith's head at your doorstep. Ja więc to ty. You? I walked her over here. And I left her. So, that piece of fabric I found near there. That was you? Yeah. I cut my leg trying to get over the fence. Hmm. So you... You started all this. I just pointed you in the right direction. People like us get forgotten all the time. The crooked man was counting on that. Tush. When we suffer, we do it in silence. And the world likes Tush, it. Tush, Nie wiem, co sądzić o twoim zachowaniu. Fade. Like we never existed. I couldn't watch that happen to Faith. Or Lily. Nobody cares about us. Not really. It's going to be different now. I promise. Things like that won't happen anymore. Not while I'm around. You'll make things right. You and Snow. I don't know. It seems like no matter what I do, it's just not enough for her. Or anyone. No. I just can't win with these people. I know it might feel that way, but they need you, Bigby. Both of you. You two make a good team. The way you look out for each other. And look out for us. Hmm. You don't see that a lot these days. I don't really know where we stand anymore. Things are just different. Huh. Things are always different. Look, Big B. After everything you've done for us, maybe they don't want to admit it, but without you, none of this would have happened. You listened when no one else would. Not so sure. You knew when to show mercy. And you brought justice to this town, finally. Because you brought the crooked man in, everyone saw who he really was. Mm -hmm. So from where I'm standing, you did the right thing. You've been given this job for a reason. Mm -hmm. And I left Faith at your doorstep because I knew... I've been making a lot of mistakes lately. But you've also done a lot of good. Don't forget that. You've changed this place. For better or worse, Fable Town wouldn't be the same without you. Thank you. To było pokrzepiające. Szkoda tylko, że skłamałaś. You're not as bad as everyone says you are. I need to tell you something. I have to tell you something. I feel like we've met before. You're trying to place me. You like my ribbon? Do you like it? Faith wore one too. What hide her beauty so she could escape his kingdom? They used to call me the little Did mermaid. Dr. Swinehart ever get back to you about Faith? He said he wanted to run more tests. I hope you find what you're looking for. I'll see you around. Wolf. Hmm.
pewna jest koniec. Ja nie wiem, co on zrozumiał, ale... Na pewno jest koniec. Okej. Okay. Uuu, więcej osób zostawiło go przy drzwi. Niedobrze. Większość wzięła go na Crooksmana na rozprawę. Sporo osób zdecydowało się go uwięzić wbrew pozorom. Dobrzy ludzie. Ludzie są dobrzy. No, prawie wszyscy zaakceptowali prezent dla Snow. I no mniej więcej jedna trzecia powiedziała to, co ja. Okej, okay, moi drodzy. Będzie coś dalej? Aha. Specjalne statystyki. Skłamałeś e, mu o zobaczeniu pięknej e, na zewnątrz apartamentów. Obiecałeś, że nie powiesz bestii, że ją zobaczyłeś. Walczyłeś z nim po przesłuchaniu. Eee, dałeś mu się napić, kiedy się o to zapytał. Pozwoliliśmy uciec od wyjazdu na farmę. Krutman, zabrałeś go do studni wiedźm. Uw znaczy ten, uwolniłeś. Pojmałeś. Okej, okay. rozwaliśmy jego miejscówkę. Piliśmy z nim. Weszliśmy z nim w układ. Poszliśmy najpierw w jego miejsce, dzięki czemu on przeżył. Eee, aha, daliśmy jej zapalić i próbowaliśmy zdjąć... Stążkę. Okej. Okay. No dobrze, no. Nasze wybory małe, które ludzie zapamiętali. Co to było? To już miało gwalenie w drzwi. Cóż, moi drodzy? Skończyło się tak że ja się zaczęłam zastanawiać, czy napra no, naprawdę odkryliśmy tę tajemnicę. Czy może jednak... Jednak to wcale nie było tak, jak znaliśmy, że było. Cóż... Nie wiem. Zakończenie... Podobało mi się, nie było złe, ale tak trochę, kurczę, nie wiem, czegoś mi znowu zabrakło, nie wiem. Może spodziewałam się takiego zakończenia jak w pierwszym sezonie The Walking Dead, ale no cóż, to jest inna gra, tak, troszeczkę inna, inna koncepcja, więc nie do końca musiało, miało się to tak skończyć. Z drugiej strony, cholera. No dobrze, fajnie, udało nam się go pojmać i tak dalej. Nie wiem, może ja to rozegrałam trochę zbyt łagodnie. Może powinnam być naprawdę tym wielkim, złym wilkiem i byłoby ciekawiej. No ale cóż, zdecydowałam się jednak podejmować łagodne decyzje. To też w sumie przyniosło nam sporo. Trochę profitów. Może nie sporo, ale trochę profitów. Dobrze, moi drodzy, ja was zostawię z napisami i coś. Mam nadzieję, że Wam się podobało. I do usłyszenia w kolejnym odcinku. Jutro pojawi się... Napisy się skończyły. E... E... Jutro pojawi się ten... odcinek z Jazzpunk. Tego w ogóle. Potem wracamy. Nie pamiętam, co będzie potem w w każdym razie albo Fallout 3, albo Wiedźmin 2, nie 3. Jeszcze raz dziękuję Wam serdecznie za oglądanie. No i cóż, zapraszam Was do przeczytania chyba komiksów. Słyszałam, że są bardzo dobre. Sama muszę się też wreszcie za nie zabrać. 
zabieram się do tego od jakiegoś czasu. No ale cóż. Jeszcze raz dzięki. Trzymajcie się.